So here we are today in the town of Newburgh, New York, under very noisy conditions. You think these cars had stopped driving by? I mean, oh my God. But I guess a little traffic's okay when you got this really nice diamond back to look at. So let's look at it. So right up front, you got this T-bone stem, like George Costanza. The stem's real name is the Tioga Avenger, and it's attached to some Avenir True Temper handlebars, which look pretty sweet. And to handle braking and gripping duties, we have Shimano levers and Diamondback grips. In case I hadn't mentioned it before, this bike is called the DB Axis, and it's by Diamondback. That makes sense. And there's your head tube decal with some dramatic shadows from the brake cables. I'm so artistic. This bike has a True Temper OX double butted chromoly frame, and I think that's really good. The front hub is a Diori XT, and so is the back hub, and so is the front derailleur, and you guessed it, Diori XT for the rear derailleur too. The brakes are by Radius, and the tires of these Pan Eracers smoke with this awesome tread. Check this out. The rims are Avenir Duro 17 aluminum. Look like they're hard anodized. The fork has more OX chromoly, which is awesome. And continuing the Avenir theme is the seat post and even a little Avenir equipped decal on the frame. Then you got this Veta gel seat with the neoprene lycra spandex covering, just like you're going skin diving. The frame also has something called brake booster seat stays, and I really don't know what that is, but I guess it makes the brakes work better. And finally, the whole frame and the fork has this beautiful 90s sort of splatter paint job, black and white. It's awesome. Now, I'm not gonna take this bike for a test ride on camera, because I would literally die out here. But I took it for a test ride earlier, and as you can imagine, all those Diori parts add up to one smooth Diamondback mountain bike. Now, I'm not gonna mention the price that I paid for this thing, but it was insignificant. And this is probably the best Diamondback, maybe the best mountain bike I've found all year. So the moral of the story is, if you spend 50 plus hours a week like I do, driving around here, there, and everywhere trying to find old bikes, every once in a while, you find a beauty like this. And then you can make a video about it with traffic zooming by in the town of Newburgh, New York. Thanks for watching.